So Google Art Project um, is not just for art. It allows to show lots of different things uh, that are happening throughout history in different cultures. So um, when we look at it, uh, when you go onto the home page of it, which we just click on the three lines and hit home, you can jump in and look at things that are happening in the Daily Digest, things that are happening today. Uh, so you can find out uh, more information and find photos of things like um, the uh, raising of the flag on Iwo Jima, and so that's happening today. And you can actually show lots of these images um, that might be interesting to some of your students. I can jump back out, out and go to home, and also I'm getting some information about um, Born on This Day, uh, Kazmir Malevich. It's a Russian painter. Um, I don't know much about that, that artist, but that might be interesting in the art classroom. Um, and also does a little bit of a culture. So today we're also talking about the premiere of the movie Train Spotting. Um, so there's all there's other stories that are happening in here, but you can also do virtual tours, which are very interesting. So you can click on the View All button on the right here, and you can see all the different uh, virtual tours that they have running through. So we have over 2,758 museum views that we can look at uh, around the world, uh, which gives your students some other options to explore different things. Um, if I hit the back button, I can hit the back button here and I can uh, search a few of the other ones. So um, when we look at the Taj Mahal, for, for example, um, you can actually do a uh, 3D walking tour of this place. I'm just double clicking to, to advance. I can kind of swipe and move um, and I can jump forward into different places and move up in space. Hopefully it's going to let me jump up there. I think I had to go up to the stairs earlier to get up there. Maybe I have to go up the ramp. Anyway, um, here we go. I'm able to jump around and do a bit of a virtual tour of the Taj Mahal. So that's kind of cool. Um, other things that are um, available through the Google Art Project Arts and Culture page uh, we can look through artists, uh, uh, so we can explore different artists' work. So if we look at Monet, we can actually jump through and look through lot, lots of their, their artwork in high detail. So if I'm looking at this painting, I can actually zoom in and keep on zooming in. Um, and it should actually get all the way down to the actual brushwork. So you can actually see the strokes and cracks in the paint, which is really amazing. So you can kind of see what, which way the brush is actually moved when we're talking about the, art, uh, the artwork here. Um, <clears throat> so there's all kinds of different things to exp explore in here, also historical figures. So we can look through uh, different uh, uh, political leaders uh, throughout uh, history. So if we want to look at, let's just say, Castro, um, it gives us a little bit more information. And this might be a great resource uh, for a research project in the future uh, for your students. So there's lots to explore within the Google Arts Project uh, site. And I'm hoping that this quick tutorial gives you um, a little bit of a understanding of this resource. Thank you for watching my, my quick little tutorial. Uh, enjoy your day.